Hello. I have some dramatic lighting courtesy of, uh, well, I guess the sun. Hi. Uh, it's, uh, it's kind of early afternoon on the 7th, uh, which is a Friday. And normally at this time, uh, I would be running Dragon Heist, uh, on D&D's Twitch channel, but instead, it's Blue Jay's birthday, and she needed the day off to do, like, birthday stream stuff, so happy birthday, Blue Jay. Uh, and uh, this morning I did the, the Farverona faction turn, which is probably the most stressful stream of all of my streams. And it's not because I don't like it or because it's, it's like negative in any way. It's just that when you create something and you're responsible for doing it justice and people really care about it and invest their own time and energy into the thing, you tend to raise the stakes, right? It tends to be very intense. And so the faction turn, where I'm processing everybody's Far Verona energy into running the game, uh, it's it can be a lot. I come out of it with a, uh, my heart pounding, and I feel like I need to lie down. <laughs> but it's good. It's, it's really cool. And I, I feel really proud of what we're building and what we've done with the faction turn. You know, it's it's a game, and it's a game that's in the middle of being designed, and it's a work in progress, so I know it's not perfect, but I hope that people are having a good time with it and that they're enjoying it. And I, I know that I've been having a good time running the the faction turn, even if it stresses me out. Because <laughs> sometimes that's what happens with the things that we love. We just feel exhausted by them. I know that I'm exhausting. So, so now the rest of my day is going to consist of doing a little bit of vlogging, which... Hi, hello, we're here for that. Uh, and then I have to pack up all my shit because I'm driving to Seattle and I'm gonna go visit Blue Jay and we're gonna do some birthday stuff. There's some kind of like medieval Yule feast happening this weekend. We're gonna shoot a bunch of photos for her Patreon, which means I need to pack my cameras, which means I have to decide which cameras I wanna pack, which is always really hard for me to do. I think I've narrowed it down to my Sony, which is my main digital, and then my new Pentax, and then probably my film Leica. Ugh. I usually bring more film cameras to Seattle than I would otherwise because I don't have to pass them through an x-ray. X-rays can be damaging to film if you run them through more than once or if they're a high sensitivity. So I just drive to Seattle and there's no x-ray machine uh, involved so I, I can feel more comfortable uh, just bringing film. I also tend to buy film when I'm in Seattle. It's easier and cheaper to get there than it is in Vancouver. It's funny that we live in a world where you can feel so connected to like global culture and economy, but still stuff like shit costs more because I live in Canada is like a thing. And not just like a currency thing. Yeah, it's weird. But I I've lived with it all my life, right? When I was a kid, you go to the store to buy a paperback Forgotten Realms novel and it's like, Eight ninety nine American or twelve ninety nine Canadian, and you're like, what is? Why is this a thing? So, anyway, driving down to Seattle, which probably means uh, about an hour or so of getting my shit together, and then it's a three hour drive over to Blue Jays for the rest of the weekend and hang out. So, the next couple of vlogs you will see will be from Seattle, and uh, they may feature uh, Blue Jay. I think we're gonna hang out with Holly a little bit. Uh, Nadja might be in there somewhere. So keep an eye out for friends in the next couple of days. I'm gonna go pack.
<sighs> okay, so after what feels like about a thousand years of driving, I have arrived in Seattle. Oh, shiny. Hi, this is Seattle. Yeah, I'm in Seattle. I'm at Blue Jay's house. <laughs> and it's Blue Jay's birthday. That's why I have this on. I don't wear this all the time. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we're going to find somewhere cool to go for dinner and hang out. And I'm just like really glad to be uh, off the road. I've made that trip. How many times do you think I've driven to Seattle? Like, just to visit you? Over a dozen? Yeah, like, uh, there's like... A lot. Uh, and it's not so bad, usually. It was really bad today, there was a lot of traffic, but... I actually don't mind. Driving is a nice time for me to... Listen to podcasts, and... Listen to music, and think about role-playing game stuff. So, I did some of all of those things. And that's it, I'm gonna go. Thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.